Welcome back Gaming with King family to another F1 Clash video and we're here for part 2 of the opening round. Uh, so we did our part 1 before. We had some great races in part 1. Uh, we, I think we put up a score of 170. Let's take a quick look. Yeah, so we put up a score of 170. We also in the first uh, part 1, we also shared with you guys how to manage your team score to get better matches uh, and stuff like that. So make sure you check that video out. Uh, if you haven't already done so. Alright, so before we jump into this one, remember to smash that like button. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you're not yet subscribed for more F1 Clash videos. And we're going to be jumping in here uh, to Silverstone. Not Silverstone, to the spa. Here we go for our next race on the spa. We kind of find ourselves getting a little bit of bad match here. A little bit of a bad match. Not the kind of match we kind of expect because we've managed our team score and kind of maneuvered through there to get some good matches but this match was a little bit off uh, but yeah let's go see where we qualify p9 p13 rival p2 p6 so he has really stronger uh drivers and stuff there all right for lewis hamilton uh we're gonna go for the odd to give him some uh, faster pit time. And for Max Verstappen, uh, we're going to go for the Tune to also give him some faster pit time. And we've also thrown in some boost that gives us good wetness and good corners, which is a good key feature uh, for the Spa. If you have not watched our boost video, make sure to watch that video so you know why we're selecting the kind of boost we are as we share in that video. Uh, the kind of boost you want to be selecting for each track. Let's go for this fast start method. See if we could dive down the inside. Nice dive there from Lewis Hamilton. Ooh, we got the... Oh, man. We glitched past the rival there, but we got pushed back. It's all right, though. So the rival is going for the downforce and the skull, which is high corners and corners and tires and grip. So, ooh, safety car right away. A safety car. Ricardo crashing on the first lap. And that's going to back up the rival uh, who is pulling away with his Lewis Hamilton there to create that distance on his medium tires. All right. So we're going to have one lap of safety and then we're going to come back. We're not going to go to pit here and lose any positions because it's just been the first lap. So it doesn't make any sense to go to pit. The rival seems to find some sense of going to pit here. Uh, what is he coming back to? Fresh mediums with his front driver so he did not go for fresh mediums with his back driver <laughs> he just went for fre fresh mediums with his front driver there as he's going to be starting off freshly on those tires it makes no sense for us to go to pit as we're going to be losing uh some position great race right there gotta give him that to him he had the distance to do so so might as well switch out those tires for some fresh tires i i personally would have gone for like some softs uh, right there because he still needs he still still he's still gonna need to make another pit stop uh, so i personally would have gone for some softs right there uh, but yeah this rival is stronger than us so we're not really necessarily looking to beat the rival or outscore the rival as we don't have the levels to do so uh, we're just looking to score as much as we possibly can whenever you matched with a rival that's stronger than you all you got to do is focus not on the rival focus on scoring against the ai's uh trying to score as much as you possibly can that's all you could do all right don't try and beat the rival or try to go up against the rival or anything like that just throw focus and scoring as much as you possibly can and you should be fine all right so right now it's going to be raining Ooh, it's going to be raining i wasn't paying attention to the rain there as well or else we could have switched for wet tires now here's the question can we make one lap before it reached 26 percent can we make one lap before it reached 26 percent all right so we have the fast pit time so we're going to commit to go to pit here to wet tires we're not going to make the one lap we're going to commit to go to, to wet tires. The rest of the pack is going to be stuck on regular tires. So we're going to boost on out. It's all right. We're going to be 26. It's now up to 30%. So our tires should be in full focus. We should be going through these uh, cars like how hot knife go through butter. But as you can see, we're stuck on butters. How are we stuck on butters on hard tires? I don't know. Hutch, 
how are we stuck on Bottas there? I don't know how we're stuck on Bottas. Verstappen stuck in the back. How are we stuck here, Hutch? Can you explain? Can you explain, Hutch? We're the only cars on wet tires. And the entire track is on regular tires and we're stuck. How are we stuck, Hutch? Please explain to me. How are we stuck? Because we should not be stuck there. We should be going through these cars. Look at that. Gasly pushing us off on regular tires while we're on wets. And we're stuck. How are we stuck there, Hutch? Still stuck on Bottas for stopping. Didn't even pit on her regular tires. 70% wetness and we got stuck. How was that even possible? Front runners haven't even pitted as yet. And look at this. We're stuck on Lewis. Now we get to slip by. Come on, Hutch. Explain. How are we stuck? Crazy. Anyways, we made a good decision there. We're going to dive back into the pits now uh, with or Hamilton. We're going to go for no servicing. Uh, Verstappen, we have one more car in front, which is Lewis Hamilton. There he goes, blocking up the road so we can dive in now behind no servicing as well. And we're back out into P2. Nice. Great. So the rival will have to work if he wants to pass us. Ooh, back out in P5. Yes, yes. Great, great. So good decision from us uh, on the pit strategy here. And as you can see, we're now out in the lead. Not in the lead. We're in front of the AIs where we want to be. So we just need our Verstappen now to pass Norris as we save on uh, servicing time so we could boost that final lap and we do have fuel to do so so we're gonna boost from there and we're gonna boost for Verstappen from here so he squeezes in front of Norris and as I said all you got to try to do is score as much as you possibly can and as you can see here great race to the rival great race well done we're scoring a 3-2-4 so we're scoring as much as we possibly can 44 points for us I'm happy for that uh, and great race. All right. Let's cut down over Verstappen so he doesn't suffer a breakdown. Or Hamilton can go to the finish there. Uh, but yeah, we should have been in a great 1-2 position right now. But uh, we got blocked up and stuck all around throughout going through the pack uh, of cars on regular tires while we were on wet tires. Way, way above the wetness uh, section. But it is what it is. I guess Hutch uh, will see these kind of things and get some information that, yeah, this needs to be fixed. <laughs> yeah, that needs to be fixed. All right, so, yeah, we as I said, we got a higher match uh, rival there. I don't know how we got matched with this rival. Uh, level 8 Lewis, level 8 Verstappen uh, with a better car as well. I don't know how did we get matched here. We shouldn't have matched with that rival, but it is what it is. Uh, let's jump into our next race. Here we go for our next race. We're on Japan for this one. Let's see what kind of qualifiers we get here. Once again, our team score prevailed. So we got a good match here for us. So we should, let's see. If we could squeeze into that P8, P9 spot, that would be nice. Let's see. P8, P12. All right, so we didn't get to squeeze into that P9 spot with Verstappen, uh, but that's all right. All right, so we're going to go again. Uh, we want some grip, so we're going to go Rooster. And for Verstappen, we want to give him something with some tires and some corners or some tires and some grip. All right, so we're going to go... Uh, let's go Taurus. Let's go Taurus. Let's go. So we have grip on one driver, Cardinals on the other driver, and we're all set. Let's go. One on softs, one on medium, so we don't get jammed up. Start off with the fast start method. Fast start method. See if Verstappen can go down the inside. There you go. Nice inside line from Max Verstappen, picking up two positions, or one position as he started in P12. So I guess he lost a position at the start, but then he regained a position. Going wide there. Down the inside now, Lewis. Inside line for Stappen. What a drive from him. All right, so we're going to cut him down. Cut this off. Let's cut down for Stappen. Ooh, we want to boost here and cut down for Stappen. We want Lewis to go in front. 
with the team orders. We don't want them to team order in any corners. And there we go, Lewis picking up Lando Norris. Nice pick up there from Lewis Hamilton. And then we're going to cut him down there. Uh, we can go four laps with Lewis on these softs. And we can go uh, four laps with Verstappen and come back to medium. So we're going to do a four, four lap strategy here. Uh, but we want to push one of our drivers to good distance so they don't struggle. So we're, what we might do is have to go three laps with Lewis instead of four laps. And then coming back to softs and do four laps. So we don't uh, stock or drivers when they go to pit. So we're gonna boost Lewis from here. Boost for step in, cut back down. We want him to do four laps. He has the good tire management to do so. And we're gonna let Lewis go and go to pit to softs with servicing. Down the inside, Lewis. Cut down so he takes the inside line, boost back up. No luck. Lewis unable to pick up P6. He's trying his best, not able to pick up. All right, so we've saved enough for or Verstappen. We're going to boost him from here. So he goes by those who are going to be going into pit. See if he can pick up anybody who's going to go to pit. So he picked up one car who's going to go to pit. Ooh, we got blocked in by who? Bottas. When did Bottas come in? Way behind us. And we got blocked in by Bottas. All right, so we got to manage these softs on or Lewis. Nice inside line there from Verstappen. Got the position up to P7. We're going to bring him on in uh, for softs. Let's see if we can go for a late pit technique on Verstappen. Now, nice. So we picked up to P5. Got the late pit down on Lando Norris there. Can we get the jump in the pits? Let's boost or Ver Hamilton from here to go by. Ooh, Norris still got a faster pit stop than us. Crazy. All right, let's cut back down Hamilton. Ooh, nice around the outside of Bottas there. Let's cut him back down there because we're not going back to pay with him. Verstappen, once again, will have to pass Norris. He got by him fairly easy. Oh, we're on the we're the only car on soft tires out by the front. So Verstappen should be able to catch up uh, fairly quickly to those guys on those regular tires. And Hamilton should be good enough. But didn't we pass Bottas? When did Bottas repass us? Two laps ago, we need Hamilton to cross the line at 50% or 45% at the best. All right, so we're in there. So we'll have to keep Ham Hamilton on conserve. As Verstappen tries to get by AI Verstappen, who's on what tires? Is that mediums? Mediums. So we should be able to squeeze by him eventually. Eventually. <laughs> we should be able to squeeze by him as he's on the harder compound and we're on the softer compound. Let's see if he's going to Red Bull team orders. If he's going to team order Perez here, who seems to be on hards. All right, so we should squeeze by both of these guys on the last lap here. Let's see if we can do so. And so he's now squeezing by Perez. Not too much on team order. We should squeeze by Perez as well. Cut down so we take the inside line. Oh, man. We tried for the inside line there. Almost got the inside line. But we should squeeze by him anyways. There we go, up to P4. Lewis Hamilton, we're not going to be able to boost him because his tires is going to run out. Uh, before we reach the finish line but we wanted, wanted to run out nice and close so we could just boost him on in we should have gone for medium tires with Hamilton it would have given us a lot more room to boost uh, on those mediums instead of going for the softs all right so we basically wasted two laps of fuel on Hamilton that we didn't use so he could have picked up uh, some extra positions uh, with that fuel so 36 points for us here uh, we'll take it and we have the higher team score than the rival uh, but our strategy was not the best strategy there for Lewis Hamilton uh, soft softs not the best strategy for Lewis there he struggled for that last four laps let's jump into our next race here we go for our next race we're on Canada for this one the dreaded Canada. 
So let's go see what we could do here at Canada. What kind of qualifiers are we gonna get? P8, P10, nice. All right, we'll take it. All right, so we're gonna be using a wild card boost here uh, at Canada, a boost I've never used before. I see a subscriber saying that it's a good boost for Canada. There we go. So we're going to use that for Canada. As a subscriber said, it was a good boost for Canada. So we want to see how good it is. And then we're going to use the Nazar two boosts uh, that we say are not too good of boosts in our boost guide videos. These guys said that they're good for Canada. So let's go and see how they perform here at Canada. Can we find a Easter egg? of these boosts performing great at Canada. Let's go see. We'll find out in a minute. <laughs> we'll find out in a minute. All right, so good start uh, from both drivers. We've picked up at least one position so far. Ooh, Hamilton trying to go down the inside. Got blocked, then he tried for the outside, but Sainz was overtaking. We see Verstappen dropping back, losing a position already. So we're gonna cut them down there. And cut down there. Hamilton looks like he wants to lose a position. Verstappen losing another position uh, in the back. Uh, while he was on boost as well. So yeah, I guess he was trying to overtake and got blocked. Alright, so we picked up. Up to P6. Verstappen still kind of stuck in P12 here. Not too good for him. He's just looking a little bit slow. Verstappen. Is he looking a little bit slow? I'm not sure. He's looking a little bit slow to me. He's looking a little bit slow compared to the rest of the pack. Alright, so we cross the line at 50% and we're going to save that last lap so we can boost that fourth lap with or Hamilton. But I don't know, Max Verstappen looks a little slow. He qualified P10, now he's down to P12. After he got such a good start, he lost two positions. Let's see if we can get him to overtake somebody. Anybody, <laughs> anybody, <laughs> let's overtake anybody for stepping. Somebody, anybody, just do something. All right, so he's not doing nothing as we kind of expected him to do nothing. As it's Canada after all, you only get to overtake when you go by pit like that. All right, so we're going to boost now or Hamilton in from here. We're going to aim for a late pit. We're going to come back to mediums. And we're going to go to finish with those mediums. And so we're not going to get signed. So we're going to put in our go to pit orders there. And then we're going to boost our Lewis Hamilton from there. So he goes by all those are in pits. And try and create some distance now for himself to come back to these softs. And boost to finish Hamilton out in P8. Max Verstappen on his way up to P5 on his way in. Hard tires, medium tires should be going to pit. All right, mediums are in. Hards probably go around for another lap. Yep, hards are going around for another lap. Exactly what we want. We don't want the hards to pit while we're pitting. We want them to go around so we can possibly pick up some time and create some distance, get a closer distance to those on hards. We have one, two cars. We're stopping in Russell P3, P4 right up the road all right so we pass p4 p3 up the road so we should get him and verstappen can he get by these guys and catch up to p4 so he can get by p3 when he, he goes to pit cut down boost back up nice inside line all right so p3 in pit don't think verstappen should get by p3 but he's going to get by p4 oh he got him he caught him right on the exit he caught him right on the exit all right, so P1 and P2 up in the lead. I doubt we're going to catch those guys. So P3, P4 looks like the finishing position here at Canada. So is it, is it because of the Herald and the Nazar boost why uh, Orace uh, got a good finish? I'm not sure. I can't say. If we get P1, then I'm going to contribute that to the Herald uh, here. But if not, uh, I can't say. I mean, the tire management on the Nazar did pretty well. And as you can see, the Herald here kind of kind of stuck on Leclerc. Trying to sneak by 
unable to sneak by and gets p3 all right so p4 p3 is that because of the herald and the nazar i'm not even sure all right i can't give them uh we'll try them again tomorrow and see if we get p3 p4 again tomorrow uh then we'll know that it's because of the boost all right but i'm using those uh tomorrow just for test purposes to see because you guys said it, they were good for the, these tracks i call those waste boosts uh, but you guys said that they were good for these tracks uh but yeah all right all right so let's take a quick look at the rival we have the higher team score we're stopping at the fastest lap there and there we go all right so let's jump on into our final race of the video here we go for our final race so race eight uae abu dhabi let's go see what we could do here all right so we're going to be running the same boost that we just run the herald and the nazar as the same boost that you use for canada is also the same boost that you could could use for uae and the same boost you could use for japan as well see qualifiers p8 p9 so we got into the good qualifying spots so let's go see uh what we could do here all right so we gave herald to lewis hamilton the herald doesn't give you uh all right let's give it to him anyways we're gonna give him the herald the herald is not the the boost of choice uh here and we're gonna give nazar nazar is okay because he has good grip uh to use on this track but uh the herald uh wasn't the boost of choice uh, but let's go see start off with the fast start method fast start method down the inside there verstappen got the entire inside open then he took advantage but then Lewis Hamilton kind of got stuck. Lewis Hamilton kind of got stuck. And Verstappen took full advantage. Even get by. Verstappen even passed Lewis there. He clearly overtook Lewis. Now let's boost back out of the slip slide. Keep that boost in that slide. And let's cut down right there. Alright. We're going to go for... How much laps are we going for, Lewis? We're going four laps with Verstappen. So we need to... I think we're doing three laps with Lewis. Nice overtake there from Lewis. Let's cut him back down. And we're going to keep first stop. Try to keep first stop. It. Ooh, maintaining P5. Norris trying to get back to the position from Lewis Hamilton. Not today, Lando Norris. Boost into the slide. Boost into the slide. So, ooh. We see Leclerc trying to slide into us there and push us off the trap. But we were boosting as well in the slide, Leclerc. Not today, Charles. As we're going to go around with or Wait, oh man, we didn't pay attention and Leclerc still got past or Verstappen. We didn't want that, but it's all right. Uh, we're going to go in for soft tires for Hamilton with no servicing. Then we're going to come for two laps and then we're going to come back for medium tires with servicing and go to finish. Let's boost in the slide or Verstappen so he doesn't get under our overtake glitched past while he's in the slide what tires is Leclerc on softs okay so he's gonna go to pit now let's boost now or Verstappen by pit see if we can pass Leclerc yes he can not be able to catch up to the Hamilton or oh it's George Russell all right so because we're boosting or Hamilton behind we're going to have to boost or Verstappen into the slide. Ooh, you got Team Arders. Hamilton still picked up the position. So in the end, it's a good trade-off. And there we go, pushing Russell out of that slide. And then we're going to put in our good pit Arders. And can Hamilton pick up first P1? There we go, Lewis Hamilton. So the Herald is putting in work here. Looks like we found a good boost. After all, seems like you guys were right about the herald after i called it a waste boost oh so let's see if we get p1 oh let's cut down or verstappen there all right nice you boost in the slide and picked up all 
All right, so we want to keep Or Verstappen nice and close <clears throat> to these guys as they'll have to go to pit one by one. Uh, they'll have to go to pit. Oh, they're on hards. So those hards might be going to finish and not going back to pit. Let's see if the Herald picked up in the slide. Yes, it did. And we're going to boost in the slide. Ooh, no chance Leclerc was going to get uh, slide us out there. Boost back around this portion of the slide. As the Herald pushing Lewis Hamilton, hunting down. Who's that? Max Verstappen. All right, so we have Lando Norris on fresh tires. Russell and Verstappen might go back to pit. But we want to be right there just in case they do. And we see Leclerc again. He's going to attack in the slide. And we're going to boost in the slide to defend. Yep, no chance for you, Leclerc. Then we're going to boost in this slide as well. There we go. Picking up to Lando Norris as well. And the Herald out in P1. Great job by the Herald boost there. As Russell and Verstappen did not go back to pit. I expect them to run out of tires, so we're saving a little bit uh, of where Verstappen. See if we can squeeze by Norris. All right, we're going to attack Norris in the slide here, so they're going to boost from here. and see if we can attack him in the slide. All right, so he got the slide good. Let's see about this slide. Down the inside. There, oh, man, he got pushed off, but we didn't take the slide. We were, in, we were right on the track. We didn't get the slide at all. We got him, though. Can we get Russell? Can we get Russell? Oh, no. What was that? What was that? Russell blocked us there. We were right beside him. He was on zero tires. And we should have just slipped by him for P3. But he blocked us. Man, that was a crazy block uh, from George Russell right there. Crazy block. He just planted his car and slammed us into the wall <laughs> on zero tires. And then we just got to move. Let him go, and then he takes uh, the position. Man, that was a crazy finish. But the Herald and the Nazar boost looks like some pretty good boosts in the end. Uh, I normally don't use those kind of boosts, uh, but in the end, they look like some pretty good boosts. As you guys told me in the comments that Game with King, check these boosts out. These boosts are pretty good boosts for tracks like Canada. And I'm like, all right, all right, I'm going to test them out. And there we go. Look, looking like those boosts turned up and they turned out all right so there we go good match for us there but yeah after or all our eight races we've managed to put up a score of i think the herald is going to be one of my new favorite boosts <laughs> yeah i think the herald is going to be one of my new favorite boosts so after all pit pass complete so 338 is our final score Tomorrow, we hope to best 338 and get a better score than 338 tomorrow. Hopefully, uh, we can get a better score. Use code word uh, medals down below to let me know that you made it to this portion of the video. So our first race and our sixth race, uh, we should look to put up some better score in those races tomorrow. All right. Uh, and that's basically going to be it. Let me know down in the comments how you guys are doing in your event. Uh and so on let me know if you're using the boost guide video uh, to help you select your boost uh, for these tracks all right so that's basically going to be it for this one and i'll see you guys in the next one peace walk good guys bye shout out to marco pedrana vid mantis christopher graves alfredo jr and touch my dealing.